1990s, something very wonderful happened. There was a powerful renaissance in acoustic music, and in particular, the acoustic guitar. And a lot of this was due to Eric Clapton's MTV Unplugged appearance. <laughs> Clapton took the stage for that session with, amongst other instruments, a 1939 Martin 00042. If you've ever had the chance to play one of these, I have on two occasions, uh, you'll know that they can be clock-stoppingly incredible instruments. And this performance led directly to the guitar that I'm holding in my hands. This is a Martin 00028 Eric Clapton signature model. Eric Clapton Unplugged was a big album for all guitarists at the time. Now, I grew up in the shadow of a uh, guitar shop. I was doomed, right from the start. And I used to walk past and I'd see a lot of pointy straps with uh, double humbuckers and Floyd Roses and, and you know, really dangerous headstocks. Uh, maybe one humbucker with a single volume knob. And that was it, just to show how serious you were. There were some acoustics in that window. I remember seeing sunbursts and bowlbacks and all that sort of thing. And then one day I saw one of these. While there is a 12 fret version of Martin's triple O design, this is the 14 fretter. So essentially, it's an OM or orchestra model, but with a shorter scale length of 24.9 inches. This makes things like string bends and expressive vibrato a lot easier than a full scale guitar, and it also gives you that beautiful warm short scale sound. Unlike the 39 triple O that Clapton plays in the MTV special, this guitar features Indian rosewood on the back and sides instead of Brazilian with a sick spruce top. The first Eric Clapton signature model that Martin released was a style 42 triple O in Brazilian rosewood, but that was in limited numbers only. And in fact, it has been revisited in Madagascar rosewood and Ziracote since then. Aside from that, it's just a great example of what Martin do best. Straight ahead, acoustic tone. And I wanted to share a little bit of that with you today. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay tuned. Mm -hmm.